Hey everybody. We love going to Kittery, Maine. Uh, first of all, for the food, the fact that it's Maine, but they've also got some great outlets. And uh, Le Creuset is very well known as far as a cooking pan, kind of heirloom pans they end up being, because these guys last forever. And we added a collection slowly. You've probably seen our multi pan that we used to cook in a lot of um, preparation videos. So we decided to treat ourselves and go into Le Creuset. Who doesn't love the color? I mean, color is a big deal now. I didn't realize orange. that till, till we went into one of the stores and it's like color everywhere. Okay, and how cool is it that we're filming this on Halloween and it's got black and orange, okay? There we go. So here we go. Um, this one, was, this was a coup. We were very excited about this. I love the kiwi and palm green. And we walked in and guess what they had for 35% off? Enamel. Look at that. Made in France. This thing is heavy. This is a heavy bottom pan. It is a paella pan intended for the Spanish rice dish, but there are so many things you can use because this is enamel with cast iron on the inside of it. So you get all of the benefits of the regular enamel cru Le Creuset and the benefit of cast iron. So this was exciting. This guy was about $234. We got him 35% off that day. They were having an incredible sale matches the other one. The thing about Le Creuset, it's going to cost you money, but you figure they're going to last 10 to 20 years if you handle them correctly. So it's a much better investment Some in longer. our opinion. And we use our Balti for everything. And I figure oh, this is just- How long have we been it. using that? We've been using the Balti almost daily for a little over three years now. Three years and it still looks great. It's perfect. So taking care of them and they're simple. They can put up with a lot. They also work with a um, induction burner. They work with gas. They work with regular electric. And it's something that you don't need a lot of pans if you don't have a lot of room. Even though it's cast iron, we don't use metal in it. We have another set of, these are bamboo spoons. You can get pretty much anywhere. Just sort of rip this open. So bamboo and uh, what, silicone? Should, bamboo and silicone I like for this type of stuff, especially if you have any of the really hard nonstick. Personally, this one, useless, bye-bye. Yeah, they're in the trash. These are all useful, even if you drop them. Well, you throw them on the floor, but this is still a good one. Yeah, you're looking at a dollar piece. I'm not meaning to tell you. It's one I like to use, anyhow. I love that one. And then this one with a nice little edge on there you it. Go. And this, if you need to strain something. So you get the gist of that. So you have broken ones around the, around the house? Throw them out. Throw them out. Buy you some new ones. Them. Don't cost you that much money. And you'll, and this will last for a long time. All right, so we're going to say goodbye to... Pan. Our kiwi Not goodbye for good. pan. Just and this one, pardon the box, but this the heavy one's been sitting on this one for a while. We were looking for a round all clad griddle for a long time. Couldn't find the one we wanted. The shape was discontinued. So lo and behold, there we are in Le Creuset. Same day we got that one. Uh, that one has a thing on the back. Show them up close to the back. Right here. And it shows you all of the symbols of what this guy works on. So you can use those for induction. It works on all kinds of things. So that's always good to have because sometimes it's it's really bad when you get a pan. You think it's going to work on an induction burner and it doesn't. So this has this is an anodized nonstick. Has that inside that is really 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 tough to scratch, especially if you're going to take care of it. So we have silicone turners and we wanted to have something that was easy the square shape just didn't work as well for us because we do a lot of crepes we like to do indian dosa this is tough it's got a nice weight to it but it's manageable it's a manageable it, there's nothing size. wrong with the square ones we just wanted the round ones it's a personal preference now we're going to show you some other ones so before we did that and made the trip up there we were willing to try out a few more things okay so we had gone out and we wanted to show you guys before we even used them because we got really excited about this. But this is by Woodstone. This is a Bakelite handle. It's got an aluminum back, but this is a very, very nice stone ceramic surface on it. And we bought this and the next one you're going to see, I think at Marshall's or Home Goods. This was Marshall's Home Goods, one of the two that's at right. two attached together by the house. It's like 20 this was only, this bucks. Was no, this oh. was 15. Okay. This one was 15. So. And we also got a bigger size, which is, you know, how much stuff we use is a little nuts. So this is Mineralia. I think I'm saying that right. And it's probably all not. Probably but, not. But, but hey. Uh, but it's min got all Mineralia. This. I don't know. 
So what is it, Italian? It's Italian, and this is a, it's got a stone surface pan similar to this one. Turn and it over. It this was also 15. It's got a good weight on it. It's got a rubber. The rivets are a little different than the other different, one. but it's rivets it's good. all the way through. There's nothing wrong with it. So you've got, I'm curious about this. What's nice with this one. Yeah, made in Italy. You've got a Phillips screw in there. So if this loosens for any reason, you're able to tighten it up yourself. And always look for the screws if you get a loose pan because you could probably salvage it. Now you're probably wondering why we need three pans. Three pans, uh, we'll probably go out and buy more because we're just weird that way. We have a personal Did chef and catering business, plus what we do at home, and plus the videos that we do. We like to have a lot of options. And we also like people to see if they want to practice with something. We made a what ended up being a $75 investment for this one. We wanted this. We researched it. The beauty of these two, they were only $15 a piece. So that's something that you can have and you can take care of. Get to know what you like and what you're looking for, and then you're able to upgrade at a later date. That's or just find a different know, use for things. Find a different use for it. I mean, making scrambled eggs. Um, you could do fajitas. You can make a quesadilla on something like this. You could also there. I've seen a few recipes floating around for pizzas made on the stovetop. And while you don't want to put any of these into the oven, if you're able to do that and put a cover over it, you can actually come up with a nice crispy pan pizza. A lot of stuff. So this was our haul as far as the flat pans go. So we've got some Le Creuset and a few untested from Marshalls and Home Goods, and we're pretty darn happy about that. You'll see these in action. See them in action. Great induction burner. Looking forward to using all three of them. Thank you.